linking past tense verbs. This is part three, linking past tense T sounds to consonants. Listen to these two sentences. How do I pronounce the past tense differently? Yeah, yesterday I picked flowers and gave them to somebody. Yeah, yesterday I picked flowers and gave them to somebody. That's pretty fast. Or more slowly, yesterday I picked flowers and gave them to my friend. Before linking, we need to know how to say the past tense verb when it's at the end of a thought unit. If the verb ends in a voiceless consonant, when you add an ed, it sounds like a t, an aspirated t, or a released t. Sip becomes sipped. Switch becomes switched. Pick becomes picked. Fluff becomes fluffed. Mouth becomes mouthed. Hiss becomes hissed, and fish becomes fished. But this is only before a comma or at the end of a sentence. What if the past tense verb is in the middle of a sentence? How do we link it to the next word? To link one of these T-ending past tense verbs to another consonant, use either a held T or an aspirated released T. I'll only make a held T if I'm very confident with my ability to make a held T because we want everyone to know it's past tense and not present tense. Or if the context is very clear that everyone will understand that it's past tense. On the safe side, you might just want to make an aspirated T. I'll do it both ways. Remember, if I do the held T, I'm probably speaking quite a bit faster. Yeah, yesterday I picked flowers and gave them to somebody. It's pretty fast. Or more slowly, yesterday I picked flowers and gave them to my friend. That's a little slower. Kissed people. Kissed people. Kissed people. Kissed people. Whipped cream. Whipped cream. Whipped cream. Whipped cream. Missed someone. Missed someone. Missed someone. Missed someone. Mashed potatoes. Mashed potatoes. Mashed potatoes. Mashed potatoes. Sliced bread. Sliced bread. Sliced bread. Sliced bread. I'm more likely to use a slightly aspirated T before an H or a W. Asked how. Flipped hamburgers. Mixed honey, rushed home, asked why, purchased wine, finished work, hiked with. If the past tense verb ends in a T sound, but the next word starts with a Y, you can blend the T and the Y to make a CH if you'd like. Or you can use a held T. Or you can use a slightly aspirated T. Let's try it all three ways. First, I'll do the CH, then the held T, and then the aspirated T. Purchased yesterday. Purchased yesterday. Purchased yesterday. Fixed your car. Fixed your car. Fixed your car. Watched US News. Watched US News. Watched US News. Topped your score. Topped your score. Topped your score. Liked you. Liked you. Liked you. Let's look at some sentences. I asked whether he wanted chicken and mashed potatoes for dinner. Asked whether. I released the T. Wanted chicken. I hold the D. Wanted chicken. Mashed potatoes. I release the T before potatoes. Mashed potatoes. I asked whether he wanted chicken and mashed potatoes for dinner. I asked whether he wanted chicken and mashed potatoes for dinner. I ripped the holes in my jeans and then patched them up. I released the T on both of those. Ripped the holes, patched them up. I ripped the holes in my jeans and then patched them up. I ripped the holes in my jeans and then patched them up. 
We asked Howard for the case to be rescheduled next month. Asked Howard, I released T before the H in Howard. Rescheduled next. I hold the D after the L in schedule. Rescheduled next month. We asked Howard for the case to be rescheduled next month. We asked Howard for the case to be rescheduled next month. He breathed heavily after he finished climbing the stairs. He breathed heavily. I let out a little D before the H and heavily. Breathed heavily. Finished climbing. I do a held T there, but I could just as easily see someone doing a clear T. Finished climbing. Either one is okay. He breathed heavily after he finished climbing the stairs. He breathed heavily after he finished climbing the stairs. Find the full version of this lesson with more examples and practice audio in my online rhythm course on Udemy or Skillshare. Find the links in the description to this video.